Fishing goes back a long way in my family, from my great-grandfather to my grandfather to my father, me, and now my grandchildren. And it uh, seems to be that there's fishing in my DNA. Knowing that I'm going to wheel them is just so exciting to me. We do all the preparation first. You know, we've got to select the rods. We've got to select the uh, tyre pressures, make sure everything's okay with the trailer. Then we put the trailer onto the car, making sure that all those connections are right. You've got to be very careful. And then off we go. Yep, okay. No. okay. I'm excited to think that I've looked after this boat now for 45 years and uh, it's just been a second wife to me almost. Each time I come through here I wonder at the sights of all these gum trees. The beautiful fresh air on the top of a spur and knowing that I'm on the way to my favourite fishing spot. Here we go Tommy, here we go. I think that fishing gives you just so much, so much to look forward to. It's like having, having something going on in your mind that ultimately is going to happen. You know, if you knew what was going to happen in the next 10 minutes, you'd be bored. But fishing isn't like that. You can get a, a bite of a fish in, in, the, in the next split second. So you're always anticipating what's going to happen and it's the joy of anticipation that, that gives people the will to, to live and, and wake up tomorrow morning. What's going to happen tomorrow morning? I anticipate this, I anticipate that. Anticipation is just such an important part of enjoying life rather than be able to know what's going on, it becomes boring. That sums up fishing. Fishing is just a, a thing that you do that is the great unknown. Okay, we're gonna start it. <laughs> Fishing is just like real life. You must take your opportunities when they're presented. The day may be the day. Old fishermen always say that when the wind is from the east, the fish bite the least. And when the wind is from the west, the fish bite the best. 
this place is my happy place. I just love coming here. It's like coming home after you've been away. You feel contented. You're relaxed. Your whole mind and body is being repaired by the fresh air and the freedom that you experience. If I knew what was going to happen, then I wouldn't be worried about it all. If I knew what was going to happen, there'd be no worry or joy or happiness. I'd just know what was happening. But to not know what's going to happen, look, it's, it's the same as when you're going to die. Nobody knows when you're going to die. Not that you look forward to dying, but the, the point of the matter is that you anticipate sooner or later you're going to die. So before you die, you've got to get a fish. So that's why I come fishing. <laughs>